Hello guys, welcome back to Concrete Elbow. Branshaw is getting his arm wrestling techniques perfected by Devin. In this video, you can see Devin training Brian's side pressure. But interestingly, Brian was doing this move inside, meaning that his hand stayed inside of his shoulder line. And it also means that he's still not letting his whole body to help him pin Devin's hand. It's probably gonna take some more time for Brian to realize that his raw full body strength and his sheer mass are two of his biggest advantages and he should incorporate it more to his movements. But even without those, you can still see that Devin was having such a hard time holding Brian's pressure. Later, Brian was also seen teaching, I suppose, his cameraman some arm wrestling as well. And Devin was the one who was recording this video, by the way. And I can tell you, if you watched the full video yourself, you'd know that Devin's really happy and proud of Brian for joining the arm wrestling community. And the source of all the full video and pictures that I used in this video are linked in the description below, by the way. So make sure to check them out later. But this is what Devin said afterwards. Yeah. No, James. That'll be fun. Man. No, yeah, I'm, I'm excited. That'll be cool. But we, we'll that's, take it. that's pretty that's fucking awesome. scary. Yeah, seriously, it's seriously it's pretty scary. Cool. A few hours ago, Devin also mentioned Core Sports, Engin, Levan, and me on his Instagram stories. And look, it's a photo of Brian's table, with an arrow pointing from Brian's elbow pad to his winning pin line with rest in peace Levan written just below it. I'm not sure who wrote this thing, was it Brian or was it Devin? But I'm leaning towards Devin though. I don't think this is a Brian Shaw kind of thing. But honestly, I'm curious, what was Brian's reaction to this? But either way, this means that Devin is really confident that he will be able to finally avenge his losses from Levon one day. Not by himself, but by Brian. Rest in peace, Levon.